what happens when you cross one skull candy headphone with another? You, you travel too. back in time. See? I don't know how to tell time though, so... <laughs> you know? No, so I'd probably Jeez. travel back in time to the time that I was about to mix one skull candy with another. And then I'd just like go over from there. That would be really cool. I'd be stuck in like the twilight zone. <laughs> and of course, we are talking to Caroline with Skull Candy. How's it going? Yes! <laughs> yeah. we have, we're having a good time, we aren't we? Are, yeah. We've had a good week so far here, Joyce. We really have. And we are at the official SB gifting suite here for the ESPN SB Awards. We are. SB Awards. Where all the athletes, you don't even know who they are, come to your gifting suite. And then you get to meet them. That's right. And then you become instant cool? sports fan. It's the best. Well, I want to ask you about Skullcandy. Okay. Do you want to talk about athletes first or Skullcandy? Let's talk about Skullcandy. Oh, okay. I don't even like athletes. Okay. Oh, no. Right. Yeah, we're at the SB Lounge. <laughs> she adores athletes. Oh, they're my favorite. Okay, so Skullcandy. What do you guys tell me that's cool? These look really cool. Yeah, we're we're doing great. Um, collabs, we kind of... The guys are obsessed with sneakers, so they love to match sneakers with their headphones. Like this year, we did um, our mix master is our DJ, um, our DJ headphones. The true sound, DJ articulation. We've got a mute. We have dual channel going to mono channel. We did a World Cup for the soccer game, so we were able to make a select amount. We only made X amount of them, and they went to all the players in their locker room down in South South Africa, and so. That's our World Cup. We have so Derek these, Williams. these are the World Cup headphones. Then. These are the World Cup headphones. Yes, and then these Derek Rose from the from the Bulls, and and then we've got obviously Mixmaster down here. We have the Celtics, who fortunately lost to the Lakers, my <laughs> team, for the NBA playoffs this year. So th so this is one of my favorites is the Kobe, and this is also mic'd, so you can talk on your iPhone or your BlackBerry. Oh, yes. So I'm kind of addicted. I always have a pair of headphones on. I'm always talking on my phone, and I, I like to be hands-free. So I'd say I'd say not only the look and obviously the fantastic e um, equalizer that we put in our headphones, I would say definitely just the convenience and the ease of having mic'd headphones really has totally set us apart and raised our bar. Oh, this is amazing. Stuff. Now, this one over here has an autograph on it. Who is that? Yeah, fantastic. Yeah, he's Andre Iguodala. Cool, so, he's Andre Iguodala. Okay, so he's our boy. We've got we've got a deal with him. So we made we made an AI. We made an Andre Iguodala headphone with him. He's our boy. We rep him well. He reps us well. So when you are looking at all these headphones mm -hmm. and you are seeing them with these sneakers, do you like pair them on your website or something so people know how they should match them? We up put them in the collection. We have a collection with. With each headphone, we'll we'll do like a shoe blue in in an icon and in a um, low rider, and so we we like to put them in families. And for us, those people, it keeps us organized. Oh, that is so cool. <laughs> the other part over here is we have something else that's a little bit different. Our listening station. People come. Obviously, we've got DJs here. We're all about sound here and the experience. So if someone can actually, you know, you're jamming out here, you can actually put your headphones on and you can listen to what you've got going on here and you can actually feel it out. You kind of create more of an interest and more of a bond with the product and really find which headphone is specifically for you because the headphone's like a pair of shoes. I mean, it's how it fits. If you like the color, if you like how it sounds, because each headphone is, you know, perfect for different kinds. So. These, these are so much fun. If you look at all the colors, and I will tell you that nobody doesn't like skull candy, do they? <laughs> nobody doesn't like skull candy. We're super stoked on that. And since we're at the Espen Lounge, real quick, because I know we have some people waiting here for you. You were the really cool athlete that you saw. Oh my goodness. Lamar Odom came into our booth, and I am a huge Lakers fan. So I love my LA. So Lamar Odom is uh, probably one of my favorites. But um, we've had some really, we've had some really Really good times with a lot of athletes that come through. Um, we had Eddie George, we had um, Sean. Uh, we were not going to quiz you on all of them, but I know that you had a ball. <laughs> because, she, because you know what? There's one thing I know, and this is a really long time I've known Caroline from yesterday till today, is she's always got a smile on her face. And there's one thing also is when you cross Caroline with Skullcandy, you're going to have a really good time. <laughs> Carol.
Where can people catch up with Skullcandy? Oh, awesome. Thanks. So, um, check us out, Skullcandy.com. You can check out Skullcandy TV. We're covering the ESPYs all week here. And we'll be here in our gifting suite at the W. So check us out. Thank you, Carol. Thanks, Joyce. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Now you can take this off. First thing I had, I told you, is that, as you can see, you know, it looks warm. Like, because I have not taken it off since I first got it. And I got my fresh one, so I got two now, so I'm ready to go. I like it. I like it. So, Darren, here's a serious question right here. How many times a day do you brush your teeth? <laughs> I stick to the restroom three times a day. Three times a day. Make sure you brush your tongue and make sure you rinse also. Perfect. That's how you get this. <laughs>